Let's talk about the elephant in the room, the IT band. Okay, what is it? How do I stretch it? And why do I stretch it? So the big part of the elephant in the room is you can't stretch your IT band. I said it, all right? You can't stretch it. It's actually a really strong, thick piece of connective tissue, but it is necessary to address, and we do that really truly by stretching the tissue around the IT band. That allows the stresses that the IT band uh, creates and you feel there actually be effective and, and, and address that. And so, we're not gonna use the foam roll because we've all seen it, we've all done it. I'm gonna give you a convenient stretch that you can do to address your IT band at home, at work, on the fly, on the road. And it's just simple, and that's what I like about it. If you've seen my other videos, it's all about convenience. If it's not convenient, you're not gonna do it. So here you go. Um, simply just put one leg in front of the other. Actually, let's swap this leg. Let's put one leg in the front of the other, and now we're gonna stretch this behind leg is a toe touch with a twist away. And as you do that, it puts this all on tension. And so, no, we're not stretching the IT band, but we're stretching some quads, some hamstring, and some of the glute muscles. So yes, it'll hit the piriformis, and it'll broadly hit the glutes. And so that stretch in and of itself, you'll want to do both sides and rotate away from the leg. You'll feel it, you'll know when you've got the right stretch, and it's effective because it's targeted. Again, the elephant in the room is that the IT band can't be stretched, but the tissue around it needs to be. So as you do that, you'll notice that your, your legs will move more freely as you're running, and it's just gonna make you that much more effective in your recovery and during your run. I wish you the best of luck.